Hey guys, welcome to Macintosh Weekly. And today this video is about macOS Sequoia 15.1 Developer Beta 2 Update. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. And now let's begin. Apple today provided developers with the second betas of iOS 18.1, iPadOS 18.1, and macOS Sequoia 15.1 to continue testing Apple Intelligence features. The second betas come two weeks after Apple seeded the first iOS 18.1, iPadOS 18.1, and macOS Sequoia 15.1 betas. To update your Mac to macOS Sequoia 15.1 Developer Beta 2, open System Settings. Then go to the Software Update section, then check for updates. Here you can see the update is available for my device. This macOS Sequoia 15.1 Developer Beta 2 update size is around 3.3 GB for my device. This macOS Sequoia 15.1 beta is an early preview of an update to macOS Sequoia that will be available later this fall. This beta includes an initial set of the features powered by Apple Intelligence. Click on Update Now and then agree to the SLA to begin the update on your device and enter the password when prompted. Keep in mind that once the update is downloaded, the update will take about 20 minutes to install. And as you can see, the device has been successfully updated to macOS Sequoia 15.1 Beta 2, and the build number is 24B5024E. Moving forward and talking about what's new in this build. This macOS Sequoia 15.1 Beta is an early preview of an update to macOS Sequoia that will be available later this fall. Its beta includes an initial set of the features powered by Apple Intelligence. To try the Apple Intelligence Beta, Join the waitlist in settings and you will be notified as soon as it is ready for your device. Both device language and Siri language must be set to US English and device region must be set to United States. Also, Apple Intelligence is available on Macs with M1 and later. Apple Intelligence is not currently available in China. Moving forward and talking about macOS Sequoia 15.1 Beta 2 release notes. The macOS 15.1 SDK provides support to develop apps for Mac computers running Sequoia 15.1 Beta 2. The SDK comes bundled with X16.1, available from the Mac App Store. In general, nothing new is listed. To know about the additional details about new features, resolved issues, known issues, and deprecations, please watch the macOS Sequoia Beta 6 update video. Regarding Siri known issues, some of the buttons on the macOS Siri snippets might be unresponsive when using Siri through voice. Regarding system integrity protection resolved issues, fixed, users might be incorrectly prompted when an app that is distributed through test flight attempts to access an application group container. So that was all about this build. The rest of the build seems identical. If you want to know more, check out Apple's official documentation for Mac OS Sequoia 15.1 beta release notes. So that was it. Hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any questions, just comment down below. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.